welcome to Heart of Poland with... Hello everybody, I'm Ralf Kamiński, I'm from Poland, you know, thank you. <laughs> Ralph Kaminsky. Hi. <laughs> what is the most boring, repetitive, and uninteresting question that you're constantly asked in every interview? Mm. I think like every artist is asked about it. It's like, when did you start your journey with music? I'm so tempted to ask that question, but I'm not going to. Ralph Kaminski, where is the heart of Poland? Heart of Poland is here. You have the heart of Poland? I'm trying. Because you know I'm on the search. I'm trying to keep my heart for Poland, actually, maybe. Because now I know it's there. I've been looking for it throughout the whole of our 63 or 65 episodes. Then oh, yeah. I may have to come after that heart. I don't know. Have you got a second one spare? Maybe. We'll look into this. Very well. If you could be any other living or dead Polish artist, Polish artist, okay. who would it be? I think like uh, Violetta Villas, but before her tragic story, maybe Violetta Villas during perform and, p performing in uh, Las Vegas when she had her residency much she more before Britney Spears yeah. or like you know, Celine Dion. She was the first, it was like, I think, 70s or late 60s. And she was absolutely huge at the time. She was crazy. What do you admire about her? I mean, why did you pick you her? You know, uh, she actually was so brave and she was like no one else around the world because people are so compared. Uh, actually, I think like everyone are compared to like or British or like, like, US artists, you know, and she, she's, she's so hard to compare to anyone still, you know. Um, she, and she was so, so controversial when she came here, uh, you know, when it was like communism and she was uh, like a bird, so colorful, so crazy, like, you know, she had a... A lot of people would describe you a little bit like that as well, brave. Yeah. Interesting. Very interesting. I feel like a psychologist on a, on a couch at the moment. What is the one place in Poland that you've never been to, but you know you should? It's, it's so crazy, but I never, I never visited Mazury. What? Really? But I will. I'm, I'm performing uh, this year, this summer, for the first time. And uh, yeah, that's so... That's so I don't know why, actually. That is crazy. I thought you'd say Szczecin or something, you know. Yeah, like I wasn't Szczecin. No. Thanks God, because of touring, I have a chance to visit so many places I would never actually visit. And I, w I wasn't, I never visited Białystok. I'm, I'm flabbergasted. I am surprised. I, I, very interesting. I'm sorry. When was the last time you cried, Ralph Kaminsky, and why? Oh, that was so long time ago. Really? Oh, uh, I'm uh, actually, I cried last summer at my uh, uncle's funeral. Ah. Well, that's definitely uh, yeah. a good time to cry, let's say. Um, what is your favourite Polish food? Oh, uh, Polish food, like our naleśniczki of my grandma, is like crepes, and she she does it from um, apples, from like like filling is with apples, and it's so tasty. It's mm. so it's I can I can handle like twenty. <laughs> she probably is more willing to give you more than twenty, and yeah. she rang you just before this interview. Yeah, she's. She's probably like your second manager. Uh, describe yourself she in tries one, to be one word. Crazy. Crazy. Interesting. Yeah. Oh, okay. Well, I'm so sorry. If you could travel back in time, what year of Polish history would you live in? 2009. Like my song. That's my fa favourite year. It's a catchy song, isn't it? For some people, are. I, I know that, that it's... For you, it is. It has been a song that's been accompanying me around the, uh, the entire Poland for the last week. Okay. Um, okay, uh, what is better, Polish chleb or Polska kibasa? I'm vegetarian, so, you know, maybe there is a vegan Polish kibasa, but, you know, I don't know. No, it's not the same, of course, but for, for sure, Polish bread. And there is a bread, uh, because I'm from Podkarpaty, the south of Poland. We have, the, like, this, like, I don't know, it's ca called... Uh, chleb baboni, it's like grandma's bread, and it's so tasty, like toast, burnt toast, I love burnt toast, with a lot of butter, and with this bread, it's like, wow, yes. 
Dude, you're making me hungry. If you can hear my stomach rumbling, it's thanks to Ralph's. Uh, no, it's Vivi. mine. It's Vivi. mine. It's, oh, we put the two together and you've got an earthquake on your hands. Yeah. Um, the best festival or music uh, event in Poland is? I think of festival because it's not so very commercial and uh, like atmosphere there is so, you know, chill out. Do you go in the crowd? Are you, are you amongst the crowd? Of course, like always. Of course, I love, you know, being in, it's like VIP area, but because you can see like Charlotte Gainsbourg, like crossed me and I was like, oh, this is this girl from Lars von Tears yeah. film. And I was like, oh my God, I would like love to, of course, catch her and ask for, for, for the photo, but I would never do it, you know, but yeah. Do people recognize you on the street? Yes, yes. Is yeah. it good when they do that? Of course. It makes you feel I, good. I worked for it for years. That was my dream, you know. <laughs> I'm living for it. Does it get tiring, though? Darling, I'm not Beyonce, so it's not like that. I'm not Kardashians. Yeah, okay. Uh, what are you most excited about at the moment, legally speaking? I'm most excited about my tour that we started like two weeks ago and I'm so excited and of course I can't wait for, for festivals, mm. yes. Uh, when you're on stage and you're in that zone yeah. and, and you completely are in the zone, is that where you're most calm or how do you feel when you come off the stage? I find it such a fascinating experience because it's such a two-way process, you get something back from the crowd as well. I love being on stage, I feel myself there and of course I love it, but after the show I feel so tired that actually I would like love to disappear and you know spend this time with myself to make my mind calm, you know, yeah. Mm. Do you have a, like a routine, a way to get yes, yourself in the zone? Yes, of course, I'm no. meditating. No, I'm not. No, it's, there is no time for it. I'm trying to uh, grab some snack and I have to, I'm going to, uh, to meet with my fans for now for 45 minutes because we we made it like a bit shorter because last two it was like more than two hours and it's like very your, your autograph hand yeah. starts to wither a bit no no it's like it, it doesn't problem with me I, you know i've always practicing my act autograph autographs since my primary school that's not a problem <laughs> for me it's like you know walking out but <laughs> you, you know no it's like more more you know you don't have a time to for your minds you know uh, you say you're on tour, obviously, and so you can check out Ralph Kaminsky, and I highly recommend it. Uh, yeah. what, 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 which of your songs are you now, uh, maybe, I'm not going to say bored, because that's probably not the right word. But no, just my first album, for sure. You've had enough of it, let's say. I love my first album, uh, but I, it's, I really, I feel so connected to my second album, and I want to play uh, my second album in the first place. We just playing one song from, uh, from my first album. I'm so sorry, but actually I... I said it before that I won't play my first album anymore. Interesting. If you were locked in a cell, so for quite a long time, with yeah. one other Polish person, living or dead, who would it be? Mm, oh my God. Not Violeta Villas for sure. She's <laughs> too crazy actually. Oh my God. I think with my mom. No, we would kill each other. <laughs> no, no. I don't know. Maybe someone sexy or hot, you know. Well, I guess you can write in the comments underneath this film and let us know once you come to the conclusion who okay. that would be. Um, I want you to imagine you're now in an advert uh, directly to your camera, Ralph, oh, yeah? for Poland. Yeah. How would you sell Poland to the world? Ladies and gentlemen, it's so crazy here. You have to come. <laughs> <laughs> and I think it's crazy in part thanks to Ralph uh, Kaminsky. What question have I not asked you that you would like to be asked? What question sometimes you've got in the back of your head the interviewers never ask you. Why are you so amazing? <laughs> yeah, mm, uh, as a journalist. Oh, you know, I was born like that. <laughs> no, no, I, I don't know. There is no question you, you didn't ask me. It's your, it's up to you. Some of us have a secret voice in our heads where the doubts pull us back sometimes. We feel like it's an anchor that's, that's yeah. Is there a voice of doubt sometimes telling you that you, you're not good enough or? Always, even I'm getting older, it's, it's my, like more often, when I was younger, I was so sure that I'm so good, you know, I'm best. And the time makes you like um, being so, um, 
How, how would it, like, no, humble is a good word? No, no, it's not a bad, good word. I don't know, like being so... Respectful, maybe? Of yeah, the, of the for other people and... No, I'm not like that. I'm just pretending, you know. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry, as Shakespeare said, the world's a stage and we are all but actors upon it. If you could um, say anything or something to your, the five-year-old version of the Ralph Kaminsky, what would you say to that, that little boy? You'll make your dreams come true for sure. And you'll make it for, le for real, these things you play right now and imagine you will do it when you'll be old enough or older, older what's, what's your yeah. favorite polish word Ralph Kaminski? Uh, it's żółć it's oh. the most polish word <laughs> ever because it has all all the signs uh, of uh, of pearl, pearls like dots or everything but my favorite English word is diarrhea. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> well, uh, as uh, with indeed that word, I was not expecting that. Uh, sorry, I'm um, sorry, but I, I, I'm best, trying to be honest. Where's the best city for tourists to come to? In Poland? Yeah. Hmm. Not Krakow, darling. It's so boring. It's so boring. It's like everyone are going there. No, it, no it's amazing, but it's, you know, everyone are going there. I think um, Gdańsk. You're not going to say Mazuru because you haven't. Actually, no, I'm there. sorry. <laughs> yes, Masuri for sure. Yeah, <laughs> I would Oh, uh, sorry, that was no, harsh. No, no. But it was free city. It's so it's so beautiful. It's it's a lot of to do. It's it it's it's nice during the summer, um, early autumn, and I think spring. It's so amazing. You, the support lying on the beach. You know, visiting dines, like nice cafes, restaurants, best pizza places. Yes, and and I think also like Warsaw is so so weird so ugly and so beautiful you know in some places and it's so it's so much better than berlin i'm sorry you're gonna hate me oh yes uh, god i hit mess with some serious truth bombs there Ralph. Kaminsky. yeah i know yeah you're not sorry. afraid to say what you think are you oh that's the big problem yeah really sometimes mm. i'm afraid of course yeah Ralph, we have got one of your this is, your, this is from your um uh yeah last album yeah this, uh, Yes. What's going on here? Slightly bonkers. Do you yeah, know this word? Like the, it's the best workout classes here in Poland, you know. <laughs> you can see us like being best. It's me, you know. It's your vision, this, this yeah, whole it's my, this? it's my crazy vision as always. Yes, I directed this video. It's yeah. And did it turn out the way you wanted? Oh, much better than I wanted. Did, was it frustrating to film? It was very hard to film. We really prepared for this like from the uh, from January and we actually f uh, filmed in in June so yeah it was very hard video to film but we we did succeed did you enjoy the editing process so the whole kind of the bit you I'm do always after? stressed during editing process so um, it's it's hard to make it like enjoy I mean, I'm so enjoying it when I finished you know yeah. and do you watch that video are there any of your videos on YouTube not time? anymore not anymore because I'm not watching them I'm just like giving them. I'm glad you said that because it would be slightly weird if you. If you <laughs> yeah, again, listening to my music and it, like you know what. He's it. good. Oh, oh my God! I'm so good. Oh God! Oh yeah! I'm the best. No. Well, I have to say, Ralph, I thought this was going to be a very interesting interview, and indeed it was. So thank yeah, you I'm so very glad. Much. Thank you. That was crazy. Uh, it was slightly crazy, wasn't it? Well, that's what you get from Heart of Poland, and of course, we recommend the other fascinating uh, interviews we've had with very fascinating yeah, people, just like Poland, Ralph, guys. on the Heart of Poland program. So make sure you share this episode with anyone you think might be interested in Ralph's music. I heartily recommend it. Uh, he really is a fantastic artist and I think we've got a lot more to see from Ralph Kaminsky. We have a whole bunch of other interviews with our artists, poets, people making change in the fascinating country of Poland. You can find that on the First News channel wherever you see it. Look for Heart of Poland. I'll see you again for another episode of Heart of Poland. Mm -hmm.